What up, everybody? This is Cobra Kai Season 5. So, guys, since I was behind, I didn't, um, I forgot it came out this month, which I knew it came out this month, forgot what day it was, but the show was pretty good. The spinoff was good. What well, I want to say, well, you know what I mean? The episode was good on Cobra Kai, so I was so here for that episode, and pretty much, I enjoyed it. And me see Miguel looking for his dad because he wanted to know who his father was. And we finally see this guy. And same thing with his mother trying to warn him that he's not who he think he is. And that's why Miguel's starting to see where his mother's coming from. Because they did talk. And then her and him and Sam talk. And Sam was well Because Sam had no idea that he went to Mexico. To find his father. And yeah, he did find his father. And I'm guessing he married to somebody else. And end up. End up um, chilling. And then next thing you know, he was pretty, acting pretty rational. I don't know what the hell was that. But I feel like his mind was all over the place. And now he realized that. He realized that his mother was waiting when he told her. And yeah, of course. Um, Miguel did get into a fight. His money got stolen. They let him keep the wallet, but the money was stolen. And that's why Johnny wasn't going to let that happen when he was trying to steal Johnny's money. He knew he was trying to steal from him. And of course, he fucked him up. His son helped. You know, it was a father, son, father and son vibe. That must I liked it. It was pretty amazing. So how good that was, I enjoyed it. At that moment. And. I. Just a good episode. Of course they found Miguel. He gave Miguel a hug. Miguel didn't expect to see Robbie there. And they didn't like each other. They didn't get along. Because they are upset. Because remember. Remember because. Sam got with Robbie. And that's what tits him off. And the, the crazy thing is. Miguel got with Toya. At that time. And then of course. Remember, let me cover a season ago that they um end up kissing because you remember Sam and Miguel was together on season one until he just went dark. Cobra Kai changed him and he know that feel. Everybody realized it, but um, how much I enjoyed the episode. We did see new character. That woman was not to be fucked with. She was crazy just like Silver. I can see why her, those two can be. It's like those two can relate because how crazy they are and how, you know what I'm saying, how messed up it is. And then it's like the old stuff was back when he was young. That's how naive he was. And then we see, um, we see, um, what was his name? Oh my goodness, now I forgot. Now I forgot. <sighs> It's whatever, but yeah, he also talking to his therapist, saying that he made friends and saying that um, he had rock. He said Johnny was his best student, cause that's why he keep bringing him up. We know Johnny don't want nothing to do with him, because Johnny thought he changed, that he was his right hand man, until he took over, and then of course Silver took bo took over because he set him up last season. About him attacking, um, attacking the dude when he didn't, wasn't even there. He didn't want to attack him. And then he realized, because I know he was afraid to go to the police with Sam and them confronting him. They wanted the truth why, why he was in jail. Because let's not forget, he did escape out of jail because as he was talking to him, he pickpocketed her and took it. And I don't think she knows until that time. She was being pickpocket. No one can feel that. Even I can't. But yeah. He escaped. Soon as he faked his death, it was a setup. Cause you remember, the sensei owned him. And he set this up to get her out of here. He escaped because he faked his death. And we know he wasn't. He faked his death. He wasn't dead. He 
we thought he was dead, but he faked his death. So yeah, they did that twice or three times. It was Jello, and they got out of there. And of course, I think Crease. Nah, no. I think Crease let him let him live. Well, he didn't kill them. He just knocked them out. And thing is, we know that Silver's locked up. I feel like he's gonna get out. I don't think he's over. We got to see Michael McKinney, if I'm saying his name right. Probably not. But it was good to see him again. He looked a lot different. He owned the furniture store, and now he lost it because of Silver. He destroyed his business. Somebody else did his dirty work. And he think that um, Johnny did it. Not Johnny. Um, Daniel. He think Daniel did it, but he didn't do it. And, of course, that's why he got scruffy mustache and beard. I don't know if his wife left him or not, but I feel like he could fix it. And um, you got Chosen also want to fix things with the girl that he wanted to be with. And guess what? I think it's going to happen and if they do come back with season six. Because I don't know if it's been new yet. And we know you got uh, Kenny Bully still being a bully because of the Cobra Kai. Brainwashing all of them. And now they're all starting to wake up. Now they know that when they saw the proof, because Toy knew about it. And of course, he kept it to herself right now because when she was talking to Chris, she wanted to get out. And she asked, how long going to be in here? How long going to stay in here? Because he want, she want free. She want out. Because she didn't like what's going on. And they made her break her finger when she kept punching those steels. She broke her finger. And now she had to wear those bandages. Well, at least those type of bandages for a while to heal. I'm sure if they do season six, it will heal back. And I think, I don't think it's over. I just don't know yet. I guess we'll see. We don't know if they're going to do season six. And when they do, it's going to be in 2023. I'm looking forward to it, guys. Um, Anyway, I do enjoy the show. It was a back and forth moment. And everybody made it. You know what I'm saying? Um, Johnny and um, Miguel's mother, they're about to have a baby. Um, congratulations to her. I didn't know that was possible for her again. How old was them on the show? I'm guessing they had to be in their 40s and stuff like that, in my opinion. Because you got to pretend to be younger. So, yeah. Oh, that time when Johnny was... Not Johnny. Why keep saying it? That time that Daniel had was weeks from booze because he think his, his wife left him. She didn't divorce him because there was too much going on. And she realized Terry did this trying to break up their marriage. That almost worked, actually. But it didn't. And then you got her mom, Fenemy, a.k.a. Bullion, came here trying to ruin their conversation. And we found the girl, you know that woman that she, that Madea used to hang with? And that said there was a couple, they probably was friends. And she know, she saw what it's like to be bullied because she was there. Now, I don't know if she know karate and all that, but I don't think she does. But she was there when Danny was being bullied. Because she remember Terry Silver. She know Terry Silver. I think that's his name. And, yeah. That's where it was. And then the fight happened at the bar. They were just shoving each other because they're not a fighter. And that's what Sam said today. And she also had a conversation with her brother. Wondering what was going on and stuff because his brother was being bullied. Remember, her brother was a bully last season. Then he changed. And he realized... Because they talk to him. Now, he do know, I can't say he know Kawhi because I never seen him fight yet. But they, he was trying to train with them. He still need more practice. So that's where it was. And then a fight did happen when they broke it to the um, Cobra Kai just to get the proof. And boy, he, so it was exposed. Now, I don't know where that chick go. Because she disappeared when Silver was arrested. Because we didn't see her in handcuff. So, yeah. Of course, Michael would, you know, want to kill him. For what he did to his business. And, of course, he also... He also got knocked out. Then he got up and saved um, Johnny's life. 
So pretty much, it's over for, but I feel like it's not over. Cause like I said, Crease did escape by using her card, her past card. You know what I mean, her past. Or, well, you know, her ID. But that's all I got to say. I do enjoy it. It was a good episode, good season. I can't wait till they do the next one or will it be the next season. Shout out to Sam and um Toy working together and shout out to Robbie and um Miguel. They're cool too. So I like that. Peace out guys.